Hello and welcome to my newest video. Today I'm going to take a first look at D-World, which stands for Decentralized World. And what is it basically? Well, it's a map of, well, the whole world right now. And you can buy different areas of this world. You can buy all the areas of the world if you want to for a very low price. Each of these different so-called plots, plots are the different areas um, that you can buy and then you can hopefully sell them for a higher price later down the line. And the main goal of this game by the developer or stated by the developer, I think, is to have advertising space. So people know about this game, um, the awareness has already increased uh, tenfold and hopefully it can grow into something more professional where basically companies or brands or institutions can um, buy or purchase these advertising spaces um, and then have their commercials on them or whatever it may be and um, right now what makes this really interesting is that you can buy it for a very low initial price I think it's around 0 0.01 um, ethereum which is around ten dollars a little bit less with ethereum being down and um, most of the people go for popular landmarks so basically a lot of landmarks are already owned by different people and they hope that someone else buys this landmark from them so you can basically be the owner of a revy like for from the can basically be the owner of the white house you can be the owner of the big ban uh, in the uk but you can also have a different um, perspective on this game and you can choose to own um, popular stadiums of basketball teams other sports teams foot american football teams i think there is a wide range of different opportunities to to be um, taken here. So yeah again um, as I said before this is quite unique unique because it hasn't been done before in this way and I think the idea or the goal to have advertising space based on the map, the whole map, is quite interesting and I think it makes for um, a very unique uh, gaming experience if you want to call it that. Now let me just dive more deep into this different gameplay that you have right now. So you have the map as you can see here and these different plots are uh, basically owned by people. You can upload your own image uh, that you can choose for yourself uh, to make the plot more appealing. So basically if you have a stadium you most likely will put up an um, image of the stadium um, and you have to zoom in to see how many plots are already owned as there are quite many as you can see here already take some time to load because there are so many different plots owned and obviously if you have a very popular um, country or city let me just check for London which I think is the most popular right now uh, in New York as well you can see here all these different plots that are already owned by people so people have bought them for the initial price of 0 0.1 I'm sorry 0 0.0 point, uh, 0 0.01 ethereum which is again roughly around one to two dollars I'm sorry 10 to 12 dollars um, and then hopefully someone else buy them from there. As you can see there are already memes established here by some people from uh, of Emma Watson for example which is quite interesting and funny. Um, now what makes this game more unique is that <clears throat> at the beginning there was no additional feature involved so the complexity was lacking. So <clears throat> the community got really involved with the developer and the developer got really involved with the community and um, people thought of a new way to make the game more appealing to people so basically to make it more interesting to invest into this game because mainly if you have so many plots I think it's roughly around 4 bil billion different plots to cover the whole world nobody will spend that much ethereum on it so you want to uh, improve the scarcity of different plots you want to improve on um, the, the playability of the game but also the investment potential of the game and also the uh, the hopefully reaching this end goal uh, the, the advertising space experience. So um, what the developer did in the end is create this unique feature where when you own a plot, let's say you own the Big Ben, you can hear as you see here it's owned by this contract address and you can include your um, description, you can include the title and you can also include the game, uh, I'm sorry, <laughs> you can include the image and you can set the buyout price. So someone else has to buy it for this amount. But there's also a, a secondary dynamic where um, there is an initial buyout price 
that the first owner can set, but afterwards it's forced buyout. So once the forced buyouts kick in, you can just buy it from the person and um, for the price that has been set by the system, basically. So you c after the first uh, initial set price, the, the owner cannot control the price it's being sold for anymore which again um, I think makes for an interesting dynamic um, and there's another feature which makes it more appeal even more appealing for people to invest in these plots which is when you own this plot and someone buys these plots around you which is based uh, which is basically these eight different plots in this square so basically when you own the Big Ben this 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 so this 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 and this and this these eight different plots if these are being bought then the person in the middle owns a dividend um, from these different purchases and they make up for quite a bit if you own a lot of uh, popular plots for example the person who owns the Big Ben has probably already made a lot of uh, his investment back um, and also if you then purchase this one as you can see here other people's uh, other people will purchase other plots next to you because they hope because you earn more that you will also be bought off from someone so they can earn so as you can see here that made the well a lot of these different um, plots have already been bought off because of this dynamic because people expect um, the, 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 the plots next to them to be bought and that's why they also want to own a plot next to them so that's basically the, the idea how the plots are supposed to spread later down the line and eventually if it can ever happen um, cover the whole world so yeah, let me just go through the different type of um, categories you can go to. You have my plots. That's just basically when you're locked into your MetaMask, you can see what has been going on. You can see your own plots. You can see if you have free claims left. I'm going to get to this later because there are giveaways. There are ways you can promote the game and earn free claims or free plots that you can then purchase. And I also have a valuable balance, which basically means that I have already earned I think I invested around $100, so that's 0.1 Ethereum, and I already almost made my Ethereum back, and that has been like two to three days, I think. The game is really blowing up right now. A lot of people are buying plots, and I also had, um, uh, I got lucky that people next to my plots bought uh, different new plots, so I got a dividend when they bought them. So as you can see here, these are my plots. I have the Temple Mount and Western Wall, which um, to, to me is quite quite cool because I actually own both on one plot. I didn't know that before that the Temple Mount is right next to the Western Wall. Um, I think you also call it a Wailing Wall which is all in Jerusalem. Uh, that's really hard to pronounce. Jerusalem. Um, and I already saw that a lot of people bought new plots right next to the Temple Mount and Western Wall so I already received some dividends from that. I also own the Acropolis of Athens which is already uh, also very historic a popular historical landmark in Greece, but I also own um, different plots like the Madison Square Garden, for example, where the New York Knicks play, I think, a different um, New York team in different sports as well. I'm more of a basketball fan, so I know that the New York Knicks play in there, so I hopefully gain some dividends um, by people buying plots next to the Madison Square Garden. I can just quickly show you that it has already been filled. Madison Square Garden is in New York City, and it takes some time to load. And because, as you can see here, here's my Madison Square Garden already. New Emma Watson memes have been established right next to me um, based on these different plots and people have bought around me but people have also bought around these very popular landmarks like the Chrysler Building or the um, the Empire State Building of course and all these different plots they own uh, they earn a lot of dividend based on the plots that are being purchased, uh, purchased around this eight square uh, radius. So yeah, these are my plots. As I said before, I also went for something like the Nintendo uh, headquarter in Japan, which I find quite interesting because it, maybe there are some Japani uh, Japanese players who uh, want to play this game and they thought about the Nintendo or just uh, Nintendo brand or just because the Nintendo brand is really popular around the world so maybe someone else either buys the plot for the buyout price from me um, or uh, someone buys a plot right next to the N Nintendo headquarters so I do own a dividend on a continuous uh, continuous basis. I also went for Oktoberfest which is my country Germany 
uh, is, I actually live in Munich, so this is right, right next to me, to be honest. Um, but also something like Madame Tussauds. You, you can look at these different what what plots are going to be popular in so many different ways. You can go, as I said before, you can go for historical most popular landmarks. These are the most um, the most successful ones right now. But a lot of people are also buying plots uh, and uh, next to uh, famous sports stadiums, sport brands in general. That's why I also bought uh, Paris Saint-Germain. I don't actually know how to pronounce it in, uh, in English or in German, uh, which is a really successful um, Europe soccer team or football team, depending on where you're from. And also the Oklahoma City Thunder and parts of the Heinz Field where I think the Pittsburgh Steelers play. Um, so yeah, again, these um, are my plots and you can also show these or look at these uh, your own plots basically that you bought um, uh, in this in this list and also you can see the transactions as you can see here I had some incoming transactions so that means that I made some money because someone bought a plot right next to me so I claimed the dividend and yeah there's also activity so basically I'm just gonna go through it really quickly um, you have hot plots which are based on the transactions that have happened recently I think and also the price so the Big Ben is the by far the most successful now I think it started at 0.05 Ethereum which is roughly $50 right now it's already at 1 Ethereum so you can see how how big or how, how expensive it has gotten to buy the Big Ben but also you have to remember that if you own the Big Ben you will you will actually earn a lot of dividends because there's a lot of activity going on with um, plot purchases from each other so you can also see the recent trades as you can see here, those are based, I think, on time. So when were the last uh, plots purchased from someone else? And there's also giveaway, which is really interesting. So you can er you can earn free plots right now by doing different kind of activities. You can refer refer your friends. You can uh, include your Ethereum wallet address. You can join the Discord community and so on. And you will earn the opportunity to get these uh, free plots. So if you are interested, you can also read um, more about the game on this How It Works page. So yeah, again, this video was way too long. If you want to check out um, the game, just go to dworld.io. I'm also going to leave a link in the description. You can click on it. Um, I think I'm also going to put it in the comments. I'm also going to leave a link to these different social media channels and also to the Discord channel where the developer is actually really active and he listens to the community again some of these features like the dividend for purchase plots next to you was well that they, they were basically um, uh, thought of in this discussion with the developer and the community so again if you want to be involved at a very early stage with this game develops uh, development and the progress of it uh, just join the discord and yeah again I hope you liked uh, this video comment below what you think about this game do you think it has some potential do you think it can reach this goal of being professional advertising space for companies and for brands I'm not sure yet maybe it will maybe it won't and um, yeah if you like the video leave a like maybe leave a subscription and check out the game in the comments and in the video description and I hope you learned something new about what's possible right now in crypto based ethereum based games and I hope to see you next time Bye.